Welcome to What Happened to the World Today. I'm Steve. And I'm Scott. And this is a tale of how bad life decisions led to a YouTube show. And we're going to talk about what we've noticed is going on in the world. And Scott has something very personal going on in the world for him. We've been talking about this for a while. I do. Show us your new toy. Show us your new toy. I did it because I had no choice. Because all of a sudden, my phone literally just stopped functioning. I bought the Samsung Galaxy 8 Active. Ooh, it's look at kind of, you. I, I have to get used to it. To not have the button? Yeah, I, I missed the little button because it, now it's on the screen. The problem is since it's on the screen. Push it's just, and hold. That's the trick. And I keep I keep flicking it because that's what I'm used to doing. And as a result, uh, it goes to the next thing. And it's like, there, there. That's more. more oh, there. Now so that, has, that has the edge also, right? That's got the little curved edges on the side. The no. Oh, you don't have the edge. Okay, so the active doesn't have the edge. Correct. They call it the infinity edge. Yeah. And and I did look at it, and I will admit, it's pretty sharp. I mean, when you're looking at the picture, it's like right there. There's no doubt about it. However, as I've told you and I've told other people before, to me, a phone is still basically a phone. I would much rather work on a computer to do my work than a phone. However, when you're not home, it is nice to have some computing power. But again, I'm not going to watch TV on my phone. Uh, I Why not? I, because I have a 55-inch high-definition TV to watch. Why would I want to watch a screen this big? Because you're out working in the bus and you're waiting for people yeah. to come back for some of the events you're at. I have a nook. When I'm waiting for people, I am reading. Much more better. Much more better. Yes, that's, that's awesome. I have it's good grammar. So. Um, I Ooh, don't know a lot. I got about, a message. I don't. <laughs> you have a message. You have a message. I do. I do. I think AOL doesn't do it anymore. You've got a message. You got, You've got. Oh, it. I thought it was you got mail. No, uh, probably is. But so I, I see it's brand new, but you don't have a case on it. Okay, it's a catch twenty two. The active is the one that is designed to be able to take a little bit of abuse on its own. You could drop it, you know, off, you know, out of your pocket on the floor. Right. You can throw it into a puddle as long as you don't leave it in there for an hour. It's waterproof. Excuse me. It is water resistant. Right. Nothing's waterproof because at some depth it will explode. That is correct. <laughs> Including all human life. But okay. Yeah. So I'm I'm thinking about the whole time I had my last phone, which was that big honking one that you saw, the, the uh, Galaxy Mega, which was just freaking huge and had the OtterBox on it. I'm going to say in the four years that I had that phone, I dropped it maybe three times. Um. I'm pretty careful with my phone. So I, I appreciate that. However, I live in Vegas. I don't believe you. You don't live. I, you live in the Midwest. I will gamble out here. You should not gamble there. Now, I don't know if your phone is like this, but did you notice the back of your phone? Is that Gorilla Glass also? This part? Yeah. Or it's not I'm, glass, it's plastic. Oh, okay. Because this is Gorilla Glass. I'm, okay. I'm, and I have a screen protector. On my phone, on my phone, the Note, which I have in the case now, that's glass on the back. So if I drop my phone, I can not only break the front, but I can now break the back. And that, that that's a winning bonus. I, I would say, <laughs> yeah. So you're going to gamble. I mean, you could get cases so cost effective on Amazon, like, Fifteen dollars. I say you you get one. I'll I'll help you with some manufacturers. We'll look at some. Um, we should uh, do a review on cases, and then I heard we can make money doing that too. Because then we can become an Amazon affiliate, and if somebody goes and buys the case we recommend, um, they give us money. Ooh. Yeah, like point oh 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 six cents. I'm good with that. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, t- I'll take it. I'll take it. So you're gonna gamble. You only need three thousand people, and you get a penny. Woo! You're gonna gamble no case. Not necessarily. Right okay. now, I didn't bother because it's supposed to be fairly durable. And one, the only thing I don't like about the case is it does make it a little bit bulkier. Right now, this thing fits in my pocket. I see all, everybody around. They just stick their phones in their pockets. And with my bigger phone, I could never really do that. Right. And that's all oh, I your did. I, I, this, oh, yeah. That's okay. perfect. See? Bloop. There it goes. I oh, would, you can't I pop. Wait, 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 wait. There. See? I would not put that in that pocket. 
the first time you lean over, that phone's coming down, baby. That's, well, yes. you know, no. Um, well, plus, the cases have nice little cool belt clips now that are pretty nice. Yes. I did see that. The one that I was looking at had one. Yeah. So, like I said, it's not a for sure thing. Right now, I'm just – I'm enjoying the fact that I, I look like people that I carry around on my <laughs> buses who don't have cases. You know, I feel like I'm one of the in crowd. Wow. Okay. Well, <laughs> when you drop it and it breaks, even though it's yes. an active – So, you know, because it's an active, there's no warranty or anything, right? There's no, like – it's just supposed to not break. It's not like they guarantee Correct. anything, right? That is correct. You break it, you bought it, right? Yes, unless you have the insurance, which I didn't buy. They didn't even offer it to me. And you know how weird that is? Cause those wow. Because like, they, yeah, they make money they off make, that. Because you went to the store, right? And you didn't buy it. Yeah. Online. Well, yeah, even online, they, they, they make money. The operators make money on selling you the the warranty. So now, right. headsets. Yes. I still have I'm same headset that I had before fits with this. Okay, so you usually keep the same Bluetooth. Have you seen the yeah. new ones, the really tiny ones that go in your ear that you can't even see? Kind of like the ones that uh, the guys on like NCIS and all stuff wear in the TV shows. They're not yes. that small, but they're that small. Here's right. the problem. I want to get a pair of those, but I don't want to get a pair of those. How do you prevent from losing those? The thing falls out of your ear, you drop it, it's gone. You're not going to yes. be able to find it. I, I need something with the string so that when it falls out, it's on the end of the string, and I go, oh, oh, thank goodness, it's still there. But I need, well, to, get, I need to get a I'm new a, set of headphones. I'm assuming that these are in-ear buds versus the ones that have the cord. Because I noticed that even though they've gotten a little better, they don't really fit in your ear. Right, that's the problem. But this new one probably is like the ones the – agents use because they slip right in and then they're in no 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 the, the ones that they're selling for that are cost effective are around seventy five hundred dollars okay the ones that are really good you have to go to an audiologist and they take a mold of your ear and then they get it made for you and those are like three four hundred dollars oh i should get a dozen of them yeah and they're different they're color-coded right and left so you know which one to go in because your molds are different. But, yeah. So, and and they translate like 50 or 60 languages. You hook it up to your phone and you tell it what language. And when people are speaking, it'll translate Spanish to English. So, you know. See, now, so you know now that saying. I would really enjoy because I deal with a lot of people from foreign countries. Yeah. So, you get that. But, again, it's like 350 I think five hundred dollars is retail. I think if you know the audiologist, you can get a deal. But well, I wear the headset, <laughs> which is a single ear headset. Um, oh, your headset's way. only a single ear one. It, it has to be because I'm driving. Oh, but you can put the other one in, or you only have one ear. One it only has one ear. Oh, so it's just one that hooks on your ear. It, no, it's similar to what you're wearing right now. As a matter of fact, I'm going to stand up. It's going to look a little weird, but I think I can reach it from here. Okay. I yeah. use the same you headset you in stand, my office. You standing up does look weird. Just, yes, I kind of figured as much. In case you're wondering. This is what I use. Oh, wow. Okay. okay. That's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. That's like the and old DJ it, headset. It go, yes, it goes like this. Okay. And you know, I got an ear free. I actually, when I'm driving, I do the other side because my passenger's on this side, so I keep this ear free. Cool. So I can hear people in the vehicle. And, of course, in case there's like – emergency vehicles or anything like that while I'm driving, I need to be able to hear stuff. Right, so, well, that, right. that is the law. You have, to, yep. you have to keep your ear free. But I have one that has two ear pieces with the strings on it, the thing that goes around your neck. Yes. And then I just put one in. But I've noticed that the wire is starting to fray at the ear piece. So I'm yep. like, ah, dang it. They don't last forever. Matter of fact, you lucky to get more than a year out of it. Then I'm lucky because I've had this thing for three. Well, we know you're lucky, which we will probably discuss in a future episode. <laughs> um, but I'm also thinking that uh, since you are in Vegas and you're lucky, why aren't you rich yet? Because uh, we'll I'm not that, that kind of lucky. <laughs> <laughs> no, okay. I'm not that kind of lucky. I wish I was. I'm, yes. I'm very lucky. I'm healthy. I have a good family. But uh, I don't win. I don't, I'm not the person who puts the money in and wins. I want to. No. I'm, I'm going to ask. Please, angels, give me lots of money. Give me abundance. Now, just so you know, I have won $32 on Powerball before. That's good. What was that, the Powerball? No, you'd have to have the Powerball in two numbers at least. I think it was three numbers. Wow. 
That's good. But, yeah. <laughs> Considering how many thousands of dollars I spent, yeah, it's a good investment. Yeah. Well, you know, it's my favorite thing when people get their free shirts from the casino. Or, or there, here's a great giveaway. I was driving, what? I don't remember what casino it was. But this was this week's giveaway. If you get 200 points in one day, one point, one dollar. Every dollar you gamble, one point. If you get 200 points, you get a candy dish. Woohoo! No candy, right? Just a dish. No, just a dish. Yeah. Right. I mean, Halloween's it's just coming like up. like 50 cents, they, they right? They should give okay. you the, the candy, for crying out loud, for Halloween at least. But no, it's great. So what kind of apps are you going to put on your phone? I'm working on that. It's, it's, uh, I had a, a handful on my other phone i'm not like i said i'm not big on using my phone for anything but phone calls and texting and checking the weather and stuff like that although right. instagram's good facebook's good uh twitter um well you need that for the business you need that for the show you gotta have youtube right. on there i am See? also this phone comes with bixby and i'm oh i've got to learn about it it's supposed to be awesome well we had we had that discussion right bixby cortana uh yes. google assistant it comes with google assistant also just so you know so you, yes. can have, so you can have Bixby and Google Assistants argue. Bixby, do you have the Bixby button on that? Yeah, are, are there three buttons on the one side where the volume is? No, just – oh, wait. Power button on one side, volume button on the other side, up, down, and then a button below that called the Bixby button. Yeah, no, I don't have one that says uh, Bixby. You don't have the Bixby. It doesn't say Bixby. It's just on the no. side of the phone. I have a Bixby I, button. I can push Bixby button. not set up yet. That's what this is. Uh, it's a Bixby button. So there you Bixby go. Not set up yet. There okay. You go. So yeah. So you have the Bixby button. So you push and hold that button, and you don't have to say hi, Bixby. You just push the button, and Bixby's there for you. But cool. then, if you push and hold the bottom button, then Google Assistant comes up. Right. So you can <laughs> play with the two of them. So I have the banking apps on my phone, and uh, we were you can scan checks in, you can send money, and all that stuff. So I came up with a bright idea. I had a $100 bill. I would scan the $100 bill front and back because you have to scan the front and the back. Of the, and I would just deposit that. That works. It's got the serial number right on the front. And then they put the $100 in the bank for you, right? Yeah. It that, works. It should work. I'm, I'm going to try it. Okay. So if I go to jail, <laughs> you'll know why. <laughs> well, trying, trying to make money. See, <laughs> see, I see people actually trying to do this for real. I really do. It's thinking that it's quite an acceptable process. Well, we have to get going, right? Because you're scanning all your checks in. Well, you're just going to scam. I'm going to lay out my cash. I'm going to scan my cash in. I, I don't want right. to go to the bank. I'm just, I, it's an ATM. Maybe videotape you burning it afterwards. I don't know. Uh, yeah. I'm I not, think you're allowed to burn money. Does that make me smart or does that make me just stupid or silly? Uh, uh I refuse to answer the grounds of might be incriminating myself. <laughs> or you might just be telling the truth about me. Um, so, hey, so we, so we had Nala on the show on our, on our last episode, previous episode there. We had uh, the Halloween show and uh, Nala dressed in two of her costumes. Yep. So um, what about the bunny? Any, now, any, any luck with the bunny? Well, actually, he was just up here again. He has – people don't know this, but when I'm on – the computer with you right now i'm up in my office which is actually above a three and a half car garage and we have a door that has a cat door in the bottom of it because we used to take care of a stray cat and the cat would come up to the office eat if the weather was bad it would come up the office and sleep up here but otherwise it was able to get outside apparently bunny smart Bunny found cat door, goes out, cat door ends up in garage. I walked into the garage this evening, the bunny jumped out at me, and it was like a Halloween scare. I went, whoa! <laughs> the, the bunny from uh, 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 Monty Python and the Holy Grail. Yes, yes. There, there you go. But anyway, there there is one other thing, and this actually correlates to what you were just take, talking about, you know, smart stuff. Uh -huh. did, you, did you know that bunnies are smart pill factories? Bunnies are smart pill factories. Yes, and bunnies make smart pills. Okay, <laughs> the, there's the Easter Bunny, and he. Uh, well, he does he, candy. He, he does candy and eggs, and they. Yeah, no, they put this, out little this, Hershey kisses. I mean, they right. used to tell the. So no, completely pills. different. No, okay. If, if you if you've ever been around bunnies, you'll see okay. that they leave smart pills all over the place. Okay, and the reason <laughs> they're smart pills is pretty obvious. 
Um, I had a friend come over here, you know, a while ago, and uh, he's from the city, so he was kind of cool and never saw a bunny before. And he saw. Wait, 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 wait. Just because you're from the city doesn't mean you've not seen a bunny. Okay, he's never seen a pet bunny before. All he's seen is like cottontail rabbits, you know, running the, oh, across the, car- the street. The cartoons. Like that. He's like, I mean, if well, that too. Yeah. If you go golfing, you see bunnies at the golf course. Uh, now I don't know why you say that because all the years I've been playing, I've never seen a bunny on a golf course. Really? I see squirrels, I see birds, I see geese like you would not freaking believe because we got all the lakes around here, but I have never, not even once, seen a bunny on a golf course. Wow. Uh, You'll have to come out here then. Um, All right, so smart pills. I'm back to, I'm I'm curious. Anyway, he he asked you. What they he asked were? me what they were, and I said they were smart pills, and that's you know one of the reasons that why I keep them because I you know he pays for himself, and he says I don't know I don't understand how can they be smart pills? I said no. try one, so he picked one up, put it in his mouth, and he goes no. he can't. this tastes like poop. He goes no he smart already. <laughs> he got smart already. Okay, I've told you about the three types of people in the world, right? There are more than three types, but you have a well, better class. Well, the three types that I talk about are the not so smart people. The smart people and the intelligent people. The the not so smart person touches the stove. Ow, that's hot. Ow, that's hot. Ow, that's hot. Ow, that's hot. The smart person touches the stove and goes, Ow, that's hot. I don't think I'll touch the stove again. The intelligent person goes, I saw those two idiots. I, I trust them. It's hot. I'm not going to touch the stove. So what you're saying this was the not so smart Yes. Or, well, yes. no, he would be smart if he didn't did he eat another one. Well, see, because the pill made him smarter. <laughs> the pill made him smarter. It's That's not, why they're smart he's, pills. He's, he's, not, he's, so, he's smarter now. So what, what did he get smarter at? Not trusting you or not eating, <laughs> or not eating the smart pills. Nah. Oh, he certainly didn't eat any more smart pills. <laughs> I think he's not going to trust you anymore either. Yeah. Oh, man. But th- that's okay. All right. So for future episodes, we're going to have to look at some apps. Uh, for your phone and some different ways to use your phone because the Galaxy Note and the Galaxy S have a lot of the same features in that. So I'll let you know some of the things that I did, some of the settings. There are some cool things that you can do with your phone. So we'll uh, I'll write the list down and we'll, we'll have an episode on that in the future. Now, one of the coolest it. things I found out, we'll do this really quick. Um, I went – uh, to China Lights, which we will talk about in a future episode. Yep. And um, I had never been there before, did not know the area very well. And I had, there was a day I got my phone. I had my <laughs> headset on. I mentioned to the people in the car, because one of the people wasn't sure where we're going. I says, well, we're going to Border Botanical Gardens for the China Lights. And my headset turns on and says, do you want directions to Border Botanical Gardens for China Lights? I'm like, I might be punk. <laughs> I go, Yes says, go straight ahead for 3.2 miles and turn right. And I'm like, this is so cool. Yeah, well, when you set up Bigsby, you can so you can say Bigsby, navigate to Barnes & Noble. Yeah. I, I don't know. Uh, and it'll it'll ask you, and it'll, it'll do the navigation for you. Yeah, it did right so, from the headset. So, so. I'm just right. Nobody else is hearing this. They're, they're thinking, I just know where I'm going now. This is so cool. <laughs> so you must think of some of your smart pills. Yes. <laughs> Yes, I, that's why I make so much money with them. There you go. Well, we've run our course today, so, yeah. so we want to thank you all. For, we want to thank you all for watching. And if you feel our show is not a bad life decision, then please subscribe, like, and watch our other videos and channels uh, on the computer screen. They're on that side, and on the phone, if you scroll down, they're on the bottom. You've got what happened to Las Vegas today. And you have Scott Thomas, so when you come across 80 billion Scott Thomases, you just cross the link, and the link will take you right to that Scott Thomas. Yes. And we'll see you on the next show. Have a good one. Uh-huh. 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 Uh-huh.